excited Hi. on the phone. All right, boys. Guys, get ready to go. It's outside. Oh. It's seven, <laughs> seven thirty. So I, I do definitely need to leave. Okay. So, only sits two um, this is a hot spot. I don't know what's connected to it. No. Unless you can somehow fit in the truck. And I oh, can go connected. over there. No, there's too much no, stuff back there. Yeah, it's cool. But you guys can come with me when you guys arrive. Okay. Aww. So this is just kind of your phone to do ow, stuff. Ow, 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 Unlimited ow, power. Ow, yeah, ow, exactly. Ow, Okay, Lander, I'm gonna go live on on my ow, on ow, on this. You ready ow, for Ian Utility to go live? No. Ian Utility to go live. Happy Friday! This is Ian Utility, the CEO at Attention Live. I'm here with my two boys, and I have a GoPro videotaping us in front of my face. I'm on the <laughs> phone with my CTO. I got my iPad for maps and music. I got four other iPhones. One for to go live on Instagram, one to go live on Facebook, one to go live on Twitter, and then of course I'm live here on Attention Live software. And we will see what kind of crazy little journey we have right now. But I'm about 33 seconds in to my live stream with Attention Live, and Landry and I are just making sure it's all working correctly, and I'm loving my children. I think I'm gonna go live. Landry, as soon as you confirm, I'm going live on everything else because I'm ready to get going. <laughs> Landry, can you confirm or deny? Or deny. deny. Yes, yes. Okay, I'm one minute into my stream. This could go for a long time, party people. This could go for a long time. Yeah. I know. It could go for a long Fantastic. time. Fantastic. Okay, bro. Uh, this could go for a long time. You can just stay on, but I'm not going to talk to you anymore. I'm going to talk to the party people. You ready? <laughs> uh, so, Landry, when I'm talking, that's not to you. Okay, boys, here we go. Come in close, Malachi. Okay. Really push me here. Hi. Hi. What's daddy doing? Uh, what daddy? What, what am I about to do right now? Oh, well, go live. Drive from California. Go live. You just won't look. Drive from live. California. I was away to Washington, D.C. It's yeah, pretty she, insane, if you ask me. It's very far. Uh, okay, well, well, I'll see you guys in... Yeah, it'll only take five days. I'll see you guys in New York, okay? Yes. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. Have a happy month. I'll miss yeah. you. Mm. I love you. I bless you. Mm. Mm. Love you so much. Mm. Don't tickle me. <laughs> I won't. Even though I really want to. Aww. Bye bye. Okay, I'll see you guys in a few weeks. Okay. See you okay. too. See you. Boy. Fist bump. Fist bump. Fist bump. All right. All right. Big hands. All right. Get out of here. <laughs> Have fun. Hey yo. Yeah. Uh, Twitter, Facebook, bye. Instagram, bye. YouTube. Bye. I'll be with you in just a moment. Bye. First, I'd like to thank. My sponsor of this trip, Steve Coffee, <laughs> the Keurig Killer. Uh, so I'm in my driveway right now and I'm with my friend Teo, Teo Haas. He's been doing fun, crazy things with me for a while. And um, if you're here on Twitter, you're down there. And I hope you don't mind the angle. Uh, YouTube, I'm loving you right now, right in my face. And Facebook. It's like you're my passenger. And Instagram, it's like you're back there. So we have some uh, very interesting uh, setup going on. Just gotta plug this phone in, so feeling good about that. And uh, I'm gonna hit the road, and then I'll tell you why I'm going on a month long road trip and why I'm live streaming from four phones <laughs> and a GoPro. But I'm not in a rush. I got all mine. Hmm. <laughs> Yay. So, uh, thanks for joining me, for those that are. Um, you know, I've been thinking about doing this for a long, 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 long time. Long, long time. Um, and we're just getting started, so I got my CTO on my other phone in my ear. I don't 
hear him. He's probably on mute. And, um, you know, it's really hard to explain what I've been working on the last couple of years because I'm trying to create software to empower people to create content and uh, consume content in a much better and more natural way. Uh, the reality is that all of us are naturally inclined to speak. It's why I'm so excited about Amazon Alexa and Google Assistant, Microsoft Cortana, Samsung Bixby, Apple Siri, and all the other uh, organizations out there like Soundtown that are creating interfaces for humans to talk to technology because it's natural for us. You know, that's the natural thing is for us to speak, not for us to type with two thumbs or 10 fingers. And um, as I've considered that the last couple of years, my uh, team, you know, I've built lots of companies. Uh, I've done nothing alone. You know, you wanna go fast, go by yourself. You wanna go far, go with the team. Um, I want to go far with the team. Sometimes I act like I'm a lone ranger, but uh, that's not my intention. And what we've worked on the last couple of years has been uh, a new media product with voice as the interface. And so right now, I believe we're the only people in the world that are live streaming to Amazon Alexa in real time. And so that's right here. You may not be able to see it, but right here on my phone, an old 7 Plus, <laughs> not a phone I use very often, just something I use for time lapsing. I am streaming in real time right now. So if you went to Amazon Alexa and you said, Alexa, uh, enable the skill Attention Live. And after the skill's enabled, you say, Alexa, open Attention Live. And then it says, what channel? You say, Ian Utility. You'll be able to hear my voice right now, uh, what I'm saying. And um, and why? Why create a software to live stream to Alexa? Well, that's not really the point, is Alexa alone. Uh, our software, right now, uh, the beta version, which is what I'm using, can live stream to Amazon Alexa and to YouTube. Uh, but our alpha version will also live stream to Facebook, so I don't have to use a camera right here, and live stream to Instagram, and live stream to Twitter, as well as Google Assistant, Samsung Bixby, Microsoft Cortana. And why are we doing that? We're creating one software interface, so I don't have to use a GoPro for YouTube and three other phones for the other social media sites, so I can have one phone and seamlessly be able to communicate, because there's a communication problem right now. If I want to communicate with the world, then I have to have all these different devices or go live on one device, turn it off. Go live on go live on the same device on a different account, turn it off. But if I wanna say one thing in real time to the world, then there's not really an easy way to do that because it's cost prohibitive and it's also knowledge prohibitive. You have to have several thousand dollars to buy these types of devices. You have to have several hundred dollars a month to pay for my six LTE cards I have with AT&T with the unlimited bandwidth. And then you have to have the understanding and team to support you to do something of this nature. Um, so that's a that's a real concern. Uh, excuse me for a moment. Hey Teo, why don't you go on Facebook, go on Link, go on Twitter, go on Instagram, go on the Ian Utility accounts. Just make sure the volume's working right. Maybe plug in your headset into that phone so it doesn't uh, interfere. Thanks for waiting for me to give a little instruction. Uh, so, I don't really know how to explain the problem and the solution as well as I can show it to you. So I'm leaving Aptos right now and I'm driving to Phoenix as we speak. I'm going to get to Phoenix tonight to go have dinner with my, uh, you know, basically my adopted brother. I've grown up with my whole life, He's, we've done life together and his mom and his grandma. And then tomorrow I'll be at the Phoenix Open, which is, I think, the world's largest golf tournament. I think like 200,000 people are there. It's like a half a billion dollars in sponsorship and prize money. And uh, So I'll be at the Phoenix Open tomorrow. I've never been there. It'll be fun to see what that's like. And then uh, I'll be driving to Kansas City. Uh, of course, the Super Bowl's on Sunday. I plan to arrive in Kansas City Sunday. And I'd like to uh, be there. Uh, what are you looking for? I don't have a headset. There's one right inside here inside a baggie in the bottom left. Um, and so then we'll drive to Kansas City, Rife Sunday. Um, of course, my great hope and desires that the San Francisco 49ers will win the Super Bowl. And if that's the case, then I'll be in Kansas City and ideally I'll pop into a place called IHOP, the International House of Prayer. I think they have the longest running prayer music service going 
and uh, I if if my if my desires happen, which is the Niners winning, because hey, my family's been in San Francisco since 1776, um, then there'll be a very sad group of people at IHOP, and uh, I'll be there to comfort them. And if by some chance the Kansas City Chiefs win, then IHOP will be celebrating, um, you know, in. in great passion and uh, even though it make me sad I still would like to be there for that then be driving from Kansas City to Washington DC I'll be in Washington DC all next week I'll arrive Monday and I'll be there for at least a week I have several dozen meetings lined up and I'll talk more about that in the near future then I may jump down to Puerto Rico to go see some friends and my business partners um, enjoy the warm weather and then we have a big event in Manhattan the middle of February called NFT NYC. And so I'll be there mid-Feb just to uh, do meetings and be prepared for that big uh, event that's going on. After that event is done, February 20th, my two boys who you saw at the beginning of this live stream will jump in to my car. Well, they'll fly over to New York, they'll jump in my car, and we will drive back for a week together and enjoy uh, the nation uh, with each other. And that's my oldest son, Malachi. It's his uh, 11th birthday present. His birthday's on March 3rd, so it's pretty close. By the way, Landry Woolworth, our CTO at Attention Live, he turned 36 years old today. Landry, I am loving you right now. Happy birthday. You're also on the phone with me, but still, I can't hear you. I must be on mute. That's fine. Uh, and uh, you know, we got lots of lots of attention live birthdays coming up today, J January 31st. <coughs> You're welcome, Lander. January 31st, Lander's turning 36. Uh, our other partner, Michael Mosley, he turns 48 on February 24th, and I turn 39 on March 24th. So, what's the purpose of me driving around the nation? Well, like I said. I'm going to the Phoenix Open, I'm going to Kansas City, I'll be in DC for a week, Puerto Rico for a week, maybe, Manhattan for a week, drive my kids around uh, across the nation. So that's what I'm doing. But why? Why am I doing it? Uh, because I need to show the world the problem. The problem is that I'm live streaming on YouTube through a GoPro, I'm live streaming on Twitter through a 7 Plus, and Facebook through an 11, and Instagram through an 11, and that's not a sustainable solution. And so what I'm really doing is I'm live streaming through Attention Live Software, just my voice. So although I'm live streaming video on my accounts through these devices, I don't really want to live stream video that often. Uh, I would live stream all the time if it was just audio. Uh, that's a much less uh, demanding thing. I don't have to worry about how I look. I don't have to worry about, uh, you know, how who's around me. I can just speak. <laughs> Uh, and that's that's much more desirable for me. So, all that being said, um, I'm showing the problem all month long. All month long, I'll be live streaming video. All month long, I'll be live streaming audio through our software, and I'll be saying, hey, this, what I'm doing on these devices, this is a problem. If you are Andrew Yang, and you're trying to communicate with the world, if you are Donald Trump, and you're trying to communicate with the world, and you are in a plane, you are in a car, and you want to speak to your Democratic constituents or your Republican constituents, and you want to speak in real time to the people that want to hear you, there is not an easy solution to do so. However, if a person like a politician were to use Attention Live software, they'd have one place to broadcast their voice on all the social media sites where people are already at, and all the voice devices where people will eventually be at. And then also we're adding the ability to send an archive of our broadcast to places like Spotify and iTunes and Google Podcasts. Now there's many more things I'd love to tell you about Attention Live, but I have all month to confuse you <laughs> with what we're doing and why we're doing it. So I'm just gonna keep it super simple. Attention Live is a live podcasting product. Okay, so think podcasting except for it's live. And instead of podcasting, creating, doing the prep and then creating the audio and then doing the post-production and then posting it. This type of podcasting is you press start stream and that's it. It just goes live everywhere. Uh, and I think that's the easiest way to create content. Um, I believe that this is the way people are going to want to create content in the future. Um, the other thing is uh, not just creating, but consuming. You know, the reality is like for those of you that are watching me on YouTube, 
or Twitter or Facebook or Instagram, I'm not going to hold your attention that long. It does not matter how how much you enjoy uh, watching me drive. <laughs> Uh, you know, I'm not gonna hold your attention that long. Eventually, three minutes, five minutes in, you're gonna be like, okay, enough's enough. Ian's taken enough of my bandwidth, I'm done. And you're gonna bounce, and you're gonna move on. But if you were just listening to me on your Alexa speaker, or just listening to me on YouTube, but it was audio only, or in the near future, listening to me on the Google Assistant device, or the Microsoft Verta device, or the Samsung Bixby output, or you know, Instagram, then you might stick with me for a long time. You might actually go for a long ride with me. And that's what I'm looking to do. I'm looking to create an environment that's not so demanding for people that want to learn things, that want to listen to somebody. I'm trying to create an environment that people are a little bit more apt to maybe be more sticky and stay on longer. And then an environment where people feel more confident to create this content. So that is what I'm doing. There is one other thing that's a little bit unique about this month long road trip. And that's the fact that I'll probably end up losing about 20 to 30 pounds in the next month. So as you join me from time to time, as you pop on Instagram, Facebook, Twitter, or YouTube, and watch me in my car driving to Kansas, driving to DC, going to Puerto Rico, driving to New York, coming back across the nation with my boys at the end of the month, um, I am doing a very intensive intermittent fasting regimen. Now, I did this back in April for 40 days. It was 10 days of water fasting, only water, and 30 days where I ate clean, healthy food for four hours a day, and then I uh, did not eat for 20 hours a day. Now, during those 40 days that I did 10 days only water and four day and 30 days where I ate four hours a day, I lost 43 pounds. I went from over 270 to just under 230. And I started another 40 day fast. Um, so I started that uh, 11 days ago. I, I did five day water and now I'm doing 35 days with uh, intermittent fasting. And um, you know, I started off right over 240. I'm just at about 230 now. And my anticipation is that if it's anything like it was uh, the last time, I'll probably lose another 20 or 30 pounds on the road. Um, and also this time I'm a lot more active. You know, one way I kept my weight off was I ride my one wheel all day. <laughs> I, I try to ride that uh, one wheel, which is kind of a mix between a motorcycle and a skateboard. People see me on the one wheel and they're like, what is that like? I'm like, you ever seen Avatar, the blue dude? When he asked the blue girl, when I jump on the dragon, how do I drive the bad boy? She said, plug in, it knows what you want. That's the one wheel, my friends, that's the one wheel. The one wheel knows what you want. And so there's this reality that um, because I am intermittent fasting again and because I know how to, uh, how to do this, I'm, I'm, I'm committed to it, and because I'm also, uh, you know, doing uh, all the health stuff. You know, I got all the health stuff going on as well. So because of all of that, um, there is a good chance I'll lose 20, 30 pounds. I think by the time I get back home to Santa Cruz, my home, which I will miss you so much, Santa Cruz, I'll be back, I'll be back in 28 days. Um, when I get back home, I'll probably be 200, 210 pounds, which will be the leanest I will have been long time, 15 plus years. I was over 200 pounds in like fifth grade. I'm a, I'm a big boy. Uh, got, got, got a, he, he knit me in my mother's womb to be real, real thick. I like to say I'm well insulated. So there's definitely a bit of like a reality TV show going on that I'm creating with my life right now. Now it's not, I don't have a producer. I don't have a director. Nobody's telling me what to do. Um, my team and friends and family tolerate my uh, courageous ideas. <laughs> and um, But I just basically decided to do this like three days ago. And I only got uh, my boys, their, their mama, to agree to it, you know, a couple days ago and got everybody kind of on board. I don't really have much of a plan. I just know there's a problem. And the problem is that I am not as healthy as I should be, so I'm intermittent fasting. So that's one solution. I found intermittent fasting is a solution to the problem of not being as healthy as I should be. 
And so in the next month, you'll probably see my body transform, which might be something that draws you to check in from time to time, which is what I want. I want your attention, YouTube, Twitter, Facebook, and Instagram, because I have something to tell you. There is a problem right now. And the problem is that whoever wants to communicate with the world, just for fun, I'll say Donald Trump and Andrew Yang because it's really simple and easy to understand. If Andrew Yang wants to reach all of his Democrat constituents with his message, he wants to talk to the Yang gang, it would be difficult for him to do that in real time consistently because you'd have to have so many devices and so many different cell phone LTE cards. Same with Donald Trump if he wants to speak to his Republican constituents. And so we've created a solution. The solution is called Attention Live. And I've been live streaming now through Attention on the Alexa devices. So if you go to your Amazon Alexa device and you say, Alexa, enable Attention Live, it will install our skill. If you say, Alexa, open Attention Live, it will ask you what channel. If you say, Ian Utili, then you'll be listening to what I'm saying right now in real time. So what YouTube is watching and listening to and what Twitter is watching and listening to and what Facebook is watching and listening to and Instagram is watching and listening to, you can listen to on that device. We also are live streaming the audio just to the our YouTube page. Now that's what's in beta. That works. Uh, we used it at CES to live stream CES. We used it at Project Voice to live stream Project Voice. I never told anybody we were doing it. I've kept things very, very quiet. I've been building software for over 20 years and I know the types of unexpected hurdles that come when you launch software and you start making lots of noise and that doesn't work. So I really want to make sure it worked right before I start cleaning symbols. But this is my symbol cleaning. That's what I'm doing right here. I am clanging my cymbals. I am banging my drums. I am, sorry everybody, honking my horn. And I am saying, we have created a solution for a really, really significant problem. And uh, again, that problem is it's hard to communicate with the people that want to hear you. And not that people want to hear me, you know, I don't have uh, dozens, let alone tens of thousands of people tuned in on YouTube or Twitter or Facebook or Instagram. But Andrew Yang would. Donald Trump would. CNN and Fox do. You know, mega church pastors do. Uh, university professors that are the best teachers in the world, they do. They have an audience that wants to hear from them. But they do not have an easy way to communicate with them. There is no solution. And you could tell me that Easy Stream and Restream IO and Wowza and Livestream, oh no, they have a solution. You try to set that up in your car. You try to set that up on a train. You try to set that up while you're in, in motion. You try to be at a table with somebody important that you want to communicate with that person to your audience and you try to get that software out and use it. I'm sorry, it's great software if you are a media team. It's great software if you are in a studio. It is not this. I have been live on Attention Live for 23 minutes now, in real time, on Alexa. I think we're the only people in the world that can do it. I haven't told anybody really what we're doing, and I'm just, we were perfecting our software, making sure our UI, our UX looks good, it feels good. I just got the update from my CTO. All is well. Alexa is sounding great. YouTube, we are live on YouTube. It is sounding great. Uh, Landru, um, I want to make sure I can share that YouTube link, so why don't you email that to me? So, everybody, that's what I'm doing. I'm going to be live off and on uh, throughout the course of the next month. Uh, in order to not exhaust you, I'm going to end the live stream happening by video on YouTube and Twitter and Facebook and Instagram as soon as I drive away from the ocean. I'm almost done with the ocean, but I figure um, even if you can't see the ocean, I can, and it makes me happy. And when I'm this happy, then I look happy. If I look happy, then maybe you're a little more inclined to like. I, I gotta turn around, I missed, I missed Dolan. All right, well see, that's it. I'm done, I'm done with the ocean. It's time, it's time to, uh, time to go inland. It's kind of a sad moment for me. Mm. Oh, oh, Santa Cruz, I will miss you. I'm now in Monterey, California. 
I've had over a thousand small business clients in Monterey and Santa Cruz. I, uh, like four careers ago, I helped AT&T transition to yellowpages.com from the Yellow Page book. And I was part of the team that was both implementing and training the salespeople and managers on how to sell websites back in the early 2000s and sell Ask Jeeves AdWords back before Google AdWords existed. And then eventually yeah, we rolled out the Google AdWords program and all that. And, um, you know, I learned a lot. I learned a lot, a lot, a lot, a lot, a lot having all those different customers locally. So it's funny, when I'm, whenever I drive through uh, Monterey, I often think to myself, you know, how crazy it is that as a young man, you know, in my early, early 20s, I was so fortunate to be invited uh, to work for um, AT&T. I think now it wants me to go this way again. It changed its mind. Um, Whatever, just go back to Dolan Road. I think that one might have been just to get me back on the best route. There's a lot of people on this road. Highway 1. Got a lot of traffic on you right now. Um, okay. Well, for everybody that's there, I'm loving you right now. And I hope you enjoyed that little 25 minute video. I'm going to end it so that way uh, we have uh, this as an archive. What's that? Give me a turn. Not yet, not yet. Give it a sec. And, um,. I think that's about it. I'm not sure if there's anything else I really want to say on the first video, but in conclusion, I'm intermittent fasting. I'm 11 days in, and in the next month, I'll probably lose another 20, 30 pounds. So if you want to watch me lose weight in real time, I'll be live streaming my life. Uh, also, I'm trying to show the world the problem and the solution that we've created for that problem. Yeah, I'm not, I'm not waiting to cross. This is ridiculous. I'll keep going. Um, and the problem is that in order for a person to communicate with the world, somebody like Andrew Yang or Donald Trump, to communicate with their constituents, there's not an easy way to do that right now. And we create a solution called Attention Live, ATTN.LIVE, that works seamlessly. And I will be on Attention Live, even when I stop YouTube and I stop Twitter and I stop Facebook and I stop Instagram, you can still listen to me on the road through the, your Lexus speaker or on the YouTube channel, only audio. Um, and uh, that's what I'm doing. You know, I'm driving to Phoenix right now, then Kansas City, then Washington, D.C. I'll be in D.C. for a week, then I'll likely go to Puerto Rico for a bit, be back in Manhattan, running a big conference at NYC, and then my boys fly in and we'll drive back together across the nation for my son's 11th birthday. Again, Landrew Woolworth is 36 years old today, so if you know my CTO, Landrew, shoot him a message to say happy birthday. And um, finally, I, for the first time, in my career will be raising money for my company. Um, I've built companies with lots of friends. I've helped my friends raise money, but I've never raised money for one of my companies, but I am raising money for Attention Life. My ambition is so great with this company that it would be uh, ignorant to try and do it without not only uh, the funding provided by people looking to deploy capital, but also the wisdom. Uh, that comes with those people that deploy their money for people like myself that are looking to put that money to work. And so I'm very grateful that I have so many uh, friends that are investors, um, you know, and so for all my investor friends out there, you know my number, 831-566-9692. I don't hide it, I publish it everywhere. Call me, text me, let me know if this solution to this major problem is intriguing to you. And uh, you and I and my business partner can have a conversation about what we're looking for. Uh, so I am going to raise money. Today is Landry's birthday and we are starting our fundraising campaign. This is my announcement. I am announcing we are raising money for Attention Live. Uh, I will stop prospecting on my business partner, Michael Mosley, on his 48th birthday. February 24th, I will no longer be reaching out to investors and we will spend the final month from his birthday until my birthday, March 24th, uh, figuring out who's a good investor or investors. And on March 24th this year, my 39th birthday, we will be done raising money. Um, so what we raise, we raise, and that's it. I'm, I don't, I don't friend raise. I've never done it. I don't like it. I'd rather just sell my product and my service 
That's what I've always done, but my ambition's far too great. What Twitter has done with text messaging, what YouTube has done with video, I intend to do with audio. I believe if we are successful in the next decade, we will have billions, not millions, billions, you know, as many as four billion people using our platform. Uh, with their voice. They will interact with their voice and they will listen to content by calling it forth and they will create content with their voice. Um, and if you think about the 4 billion people in the world that make less than $2.50 a day, if you think about the 2 billion people in the world that do not have access to the internet, and then you think about what's going to change in the next decade, that all those people are going to get access to the internet and maybe they, can, maybe they can't read and write. You know, maybe they can't speak English or a major language, but they can talk. And they can talk to Alexa, and they can talk to Assistant, they can talk to Bixby or Cortana or Siri. And as long as we are an application, Attention Lives an application in those different platforms, then I believe we can help unlock abundance for these people around the world by uh, helping them be compensated for creating content that others can consume. And also educate those people by creating uh, avenues for them to learn by consuming content through our platform. So that is my 30 minute introduction, everybody. I hope those on YouTube, those on Twitter, Facebook, and Instagram, I hope that you enjoyed uh, my intro. Like I said, I will still be live streaming through Attention Live. Uh, I'm not planning on turning that off. We've run uh, our live streams for I think as many as 13. Hey Landry, can you come off mute? What's the longest we've run a stream on Attention Live? It's like 13 hours? Hold on, hold on, hold on. Okay, yeah, now you're, go ahead. Okay, good, 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 good. So, we're just gonna basically run all day, everybody. So if you're interested, tune in. I'll jump back on with more video later, but right now I'm gonna stop this video and we're gonna make sure we don't go too long with video at one time because you know nobody's interested in watching video for hours and hours and hours, unless of course you're watching Gary Vaynerchuk super vlogs. Then apparently people are fine watching video for 10 hours at a time. <laughs> oh, he's post-producing that stuff and it looks good and it's well done. This is not, this is just a dude in a car with some phones. So, um, I'm loving you right now, everybody. You know, big hugs, big hugs. I've had a bunch of my friends that are spiritual people say, do you have prayer covering? Like, are people praying for you, for your safety and for your success? It's like, well, you know, feel free, feel free. I, uh, I feel very, very close with the creator. I think I, I think me, me and me and the creator, he knows what's going on. He's with me, you know? He lets me take the wheel. Jesus, he's good with me taking the wheel. We, we take the wheel together. We're co-creating this life together. And uh, I have lots of wonderful spiritual friends. And so yes, pray for me. And you know, put me on your prayer list that I will not get in a wreck. <laughs> that I will be safe. And that I will be loving and kind and gracious and uh, sensitive and empathetic and uh, thoughtful in the things that I do and say. Um, that I will uh, care well for my children uh, from afar that I will um, stay healthy, that I'll take care of myself, and I'll be successful, that we'll be successful in raising the money we need to uh, run after the ambition we have with Attention Life. Um, so yes, if you are a spiritual person and you're a big fan of prayer lists, feel free to add me. Um, and if not, then just forget about that last minute. It wasn't for you. All right, everybody, I'm loving you right now, and I'm done. So. For those of you watching me on YouTube, sorry, that's it. It's over.